beautiful people welcome back to our safe haven and for those of you who don't know me my name is obel but you can call me bell and here on this channel i really aim to inspire you by sharing my christian life journey now i balance my lifestyle through faith fashion wellness amor so if you are interested in all things positive inspirational and spiritual growth please don't forget to press the subscribe button i'm waiting thank you and make sure to put on your notification bell so whenever i come out with those videos you'll be the first to know and welcome new friends okay I'm, I'm acting a little weird. Anyway, let's just get right to the word of the day. And today we're going to talk about boundaries. Yeah, you heard it right. So like always, grab a cup of tea. Mm. I love tea, y'all. Find a little cozy spot and let's just talk about boundaries from a Christian perspective. Um, Just like... Jesus, who knew the game-changing power of setting limits, I think that we too, as Christians, we must define our boundaries with other people. Now, let's try to unpack this wisdom together. And trust me, it is a game-changer because I believe it is going to help us and help our lives in so many ways that we wouldn't even think would be possible. I personally think it helped me because I did it this year and it felt great. Now, let's dive into Matthew 10 verse 37. Jesus hits us hard with this and he said, whoever loves their father or mother more than me is not worthy of me. Like, are you serious? I'm supposed to love my mother and father, but he's saying whoever loves your father, your mother, your son, your daughter more than me, is not worthy of me. It's not worthy of him. Whoa. So that means setting boundaries isn't actually selfish. It's a crucial step towards your self-growth. Even the Son of God had lies, and we should too. Imagine this. Jesus handpicked his disciples, didn't he? Not everyone got a golden ticket to join the crew. Because some of y'all just be letting everybody in your circle. It's like, it was like a VIP access to the most exclusive club in town. So I think we too should learn from the best and set our VIP boundaries. So don't let any type of person come in your surrounding because Jesus hanged around everyone. He loved everyone, but his circle was not everyone. Okay, now let's look at Matthew 7 verse 6. He drops another truth bomb and he says, do not give dogs what is sacred. Do not throw your pearls to pigs. If you do, they may trample them under their feet and turn and tear you to pieces. Your time and energy? <laughs> yeah. So... Those are considered pearls, my friend. If you really care and value your time, I need you to guard them with everything you got. And learn to say no, because saying no is literally a superpower. And your pearls deserve to be treasured. Your journey to greatness, it really just starts with knowing how to respect and protect your sacred space. I really wish we all can just embrace the power of saying no when needed, you know, and really just learn to guard your time, your peace, your energy, like the, pre the precious treasures they are. Like your worth is everything. And knowing your worth and knowing when to put a stop and say no and to not let negativity into your space is going to be golden and it's going to be life-changing. And just remember, you're worth it. Your dreams are worth 
the protection. So my fellow lovely Bell crew, as you navigate um, this life journey with me, I just want you to remember the words of the ultimate boundary setter, okay? Jesus Christ, yes, he was a boundary setter too. So define your limits, guard your pearls if you don't remember anything, and watch as your path to greatness unfolds. This is your time, your space, and your journey. So I want you to own it. Thank you guys for joining my Christian TED Talk today. <laughs> if you found this video inspiring, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and also like button and also put, a put on your notification bell so you can keep receiving notification when I come out with those kind of content and share it with someone who you think might need a reminder, uh, need a reminder to set their boundaries. Okay, stay blessed and remember, you're loved beyond measures by your Heavenly Father. Bye, talk to you later.